Welcome back to yet another part of top 50 Excel shortcut series. If you have not seen the earlier part of this series, then please see it because you are missing something very important. I have provided the link of the same in the description box below. This is the fifth part of the series, so stay tuned. Hello, I am your tutor and welcome to my channel Learn in 5 minutes. So let's start. Number 21. Toggle absolute or relative reference. If you work regularly with formulas and cell addresses, this one shortcut is essential and will save your lot of time editing cell references to add and remove the dollar character. To use this shortcut for standard edit mode then position the cursor in or next to a cell reference you want to change then press f4 if you are using windows and command t if you are using mac each time you hit this shortcut excel will rotate one step from relative to absolute options when you hit the shortcut first time excel will make the reference absolute then row logged then column logged then relative and again back to absolute number 22 auto sum selected cells auto sum works on both rows and columns simply select an empty cell to the right or below the cells you want to sum and type alt equal to in windows and command shift t in mac excel will auto select the range you are trying to sum and insert the sum function in one step for more control you can first select the range you intend to sum including the cell where you would like the sum function to be this prevents excel from guessing wrong about the range in cases where there are blanks or text values in the sum range you can even have excel insert multiple sum functions at the same time to sum multiply columns select a range of empty cells below the columns to sum multiple rows select a range of empty cells in the column to the right of the rows and hit the shortcut in table this shortcut is ultimate you can have excel add sum formulas for an entire table in one step select a full table of numbers including empty cells below the table and to the right of the table then use this shortcut excel will add a sum function at the bottom of each column at the right of each row and at the lower right corner of the range giving you column totals row totals and a grand total all in one step this shortcut couldn't have been better than this number 23 toggle formulas on and off it can often be handy to quickly see all the formulas in a worksheet without clicking into each cell by using control back quote you can display all the formulas in a worksheet at once to dismiss the formulas and show the results of the formulas again type the same shortcut again this give you the fast way to audit a worksheet you can see where formulas are used and to check for consistency at the same time Number 24 insert function argument this shortcut is a bit underrated you don't see it mentioned much but it's pretty cool what it does is when you are entering a function after excel has recognized the function name typing control shift a in both the platforms will cause excel to enter placeholders for all the arguments for example if you type equal to date open bracket and then use this shortcut excel give you all the arguments in the date function you can then double click each argument and change it to the address or value you need i hope this shortcut will change the way you work in excel if you found this video useful please like and share this with your friends and if you have not subscribed to this channel do it right now and press the bell icon beside the subscribe button so that you don't miss on any new videos that i upload see you soon in the next video with part 6 of this series thanks for watching